Alright, this is a really quick tutorial how to get a Pokemon Go to work on your jailbroken phone. Uh, a couple things to know. If you're jailbroken, it's definitely not going to work. You need a tweak for that. If you're not jailbroken, it's not working, you probably don't have uh, iOS uh, 8 installed. Right, so the first thing you got to do is download um, Pokemon Go. Make sure you download the correct one. I already downloaded it. And right now I'm trying to open it up just so you can see what would happen without this week. And basically you're just stuck on the screen for a little bit. It kind of seems like it's loading and then it crashes. The main reason this happens is because the app will scan your phone to see if there's Cydia. It's, I believe uh, Uber does the same thing. Scans your phone, sees if there's Cydia and then doesn't want to work. It'll self-crash. So to fix this, all you have to do is go in Cydia, search, Wait for it to load, then type in TS Protector, and the one you should be looking for is TS Protector 8 Plus. So this tweak lets you basically trick any app into thinking that City is not installed. So as you can see, this one's 199, but you can still install it, and it lets you pick one app that you can trick. If you pay for it, then you have a limited number of apps that you can trick. So that's the difference. So you can still install it, like I said. So don't worry about the 199. So now we just want to install it. So all you do is just simply click install. And basically let Cydia do its thing. Now just simply restart your device. You're going to see the Apple logo and then you should be able to see your phone in a little bit. Alright, so now that it's back up, all you have to do is go into your settings. You can scroll almost all the way down until you see your tweak options. And then you click on TS Protector 8+. Let it load. You have to go to blacklist, enable your uh, app, which in my case is Pokemon, and make sure you click the enable button on the top, and that should be it. Make sure you, uh, your location device is turned on, and now we'll see if it works. And as you can see, got into my uh, login screen. So now I'm able to play Pokemon Go. And it's simple as that.